All right, Jared, how are you feeling about the event so far? Uh, feeling great. We got beautiful weather. Couldn't ask for anything better in November. Sunshine, warm, a little bit of a breeze, but it's, it's perfect overall. All right, I'm here with Larry Kane at the Surf to Sound Race. What's going through your mind right now, man? Uh, as usual, when I'm standing on the beach, I'm always thinking about how I'm going to get out. Uh, after that, it's just going to be fun. I don't get a lot of experience crashing out through waves like this, so I tend to want to pick my spot. Also, I always get a little nervous with people around me and I don't know what they're doing. Last year there was some good carnage in the start, but I'm just looking at it. Once you're out there, it's, it's awesome. How much did line choice play into uh, the advantages and disadvantages in the course? Coming in the inlet was huge. You could either go left or right or down the middle. Um, I think we chose a bad line, uh, went left, tried to stay against the wall, and everybody that went right kind of had the advantage a little bit faster line, catching some swells. How much did line selection play into how well you did or didn't do in this kind of race? Huge, huge. Line selection was really everything, so studying the course before going out uh, made a big difference. I was actually really happy with my line selection. Uh, it was really all about uh, hugging, hugging the shore in the areas where you were fighting the current and then taking advantage of the current when it was in your favor. Shredder, the shred dog, yeah, he's a maniac. He actually, uh, about a tenth of a mile before the race ended, my car's parked there and he saw me paddling and I could hear him barking constantly from then because he was just wanting to get on the water. April Zill, what did you think about the Surf to Sound event this weekend? I thought it was an absolutely fantastic event. It was great to have a hometown event instead of having travel out to one of the more distant races. Um, it was challenging as usual. We had a great push out through the surf zone followed by a challenging open ocean leg. And then the ever changing waterway in through the, the jetty and then into the intercoastal waterway. It was a really great race.